Hi guys, it's Brigitte from Aqua Arcana. Welcome to my channel, tribe. Welcome back. You are dope. I love you. I really wanted to say, uh, you all guys, whoever is on my tribe, kick ass. You're so strong, all of you. And you're very inspiring and you're very uplifting, especially during live chats. Um, if anyone has an issue, you are there for each other. So I would like to encourage that, okay? So we're doing a reading today and we're gonna kind of get into someone else's business. And I think a lot of people like that, so <laughs> why not? Um, we're gonna take a look at what it is that this person who's on your mind might want to tell you and what it is that they might not want you to know so kind of being a little bit nosy isn't it so let's get into business let's see pile number one i'm gonna give you um choices as usual from my intuitive deck whoever is new here i read from abstract too and we have a tribes uh practice time on my community tab where um, I pull cards for random people and then others read from abstract. So it's kind of practicing uh, developing your intuition. So whoever wants to join, go ahead. All right. So for pile number one, we've got this card over here. Let me just get this focused. Pile number one. Pile number two. Pile number two, let me put them up here, and pile number three, okay? So stop the video if you need some more time. I'm gonna show them all together for you so you can see a difference, okay? So that's pile number, sorry, one, two, and three, okay? Take your pick and I will start with pile number one Jesus I'm, I'm mixing them up now because it's the opposite on camera all right okay I'm gonna pull cards as we speak okay so pile number one what it is that they would want you to know what they would want to tell you Let's get into business. I'm using Steampunk Tarot, okay. We have reversed Ace of Pentacles. One second here. Then we've got Queen of Cups. Then we've got reversed Queen of Swords. Very interesting. I'm gonna pull from my intuitive deck as well. Bear with me here. Let's see. So you know, taken from the from the card that you've chosen in the first place, what I do see happening here is um, there is one person in their life um, who isn't the nicest to them. Okay, is someone who who doesn't filter words and someone who might be a little bit. Uh, a bully I do see a bully here okay so there is one person who is a bully in this scenario and um, they would also want to say that there is a need for them to start something fresh that they are very happy about and excited but it's not happening you you do have got the um, ace of pence reversed here okay this is saying it's not going as well as I have expected and maybe some of you have had a talk I do get it intuitively had a chat about something new and this person would want to say that you know what maybe you are right about something that you said before and um, something is not working out the way they want it to in uh, some cases I do see it can be a child okay maybe someone is trying for a child or did in the past and it didn't work the way they wanted it to work okay so maybe there was some issues there maybe there were some issues with pregnancy maybe you have given an advice of some sort to this person but they haven't listened so pick the scenario that suits your vibe okay let's get more into this I'm gonna get my kipper out 
and uh, let's see what's going on here. What are they talking about? We have abundance. And again, you know, Ace of Pentacles reversed, something to do with money here that maybe didn't go the way that they planned, maybe career, official. It's something to do with formalities also and with documents and there might be a person involved here who is giving them hard time. We have a gift, okay? It's... um. It seems like this person, I don't know what happened between you two guys, but it seems like this person might want to apologize, okay? Um, there was something said from your side where this person goes now, you know what, you were right. And um, thank you for this because I have changed my perspective about something and I'm now more open to whatever it is that has to be changed in me so it's a really nice vibe but be aware that this person is struggling with someone who's giving them hard time would it be at work would it be someone from it's something to do with formalities for some of you guys okay this person might be struggling with any kind of official so someone they have to go to in order to get something back in order to fix something when it comes to formalities or when it maybe some of them are dealing with court as well they do have one person who is giving them hard time who maybe wasn't as nice as they thought they were and maybe you were right about this too it's something about you being right in this situation because what they are trying to say they are like I didn't see it I didn't see it coming okay that's the card you have is the um, reversed um, well you don't even know what it means but I'm just saying you know uh, if it was a pride it would be like oh my god I see someone literally you kind of think see that um, that's how I see it maybe you see something else um, I do see a head of someone's and a back like bent trying to sneak sneak uh, behind your back and do something so you don't catch them because it's reversed they saying I haven't seen it you know and now I do it's something about this situation where um, you were right okay you were right about whatever the advice you have given or whatever it was that you have said and it's not that they are they are uncomfortable to admit it. They are fine with it. Um, they are more so like grateful to you, but they don't have time now because they are so, um, all of their attention is on this person who, to, to kind of finish the business that they have with this person who is um, giving them some sort of a struggle, okay? What they don't want to tell you, let's see. Okay, sorry, cards are all over the place what they don't want to tell you Whew. page of swords page of swords page of wands reversed what is going on here and knight of swords reversed as well let me just tune into this i'll pull keeper as well what is going on here? What they don't want to tell you. What we talking about here, Kippa? Of course. Oh shit, sorry. I have cards on all over the place now, but it doesn't matter. Look, we have the Page of Swords, okay? It's my traveler type of card. Someone who wants to go and explore. We do have Journey Reversed. Whatever journey that they are planning to take or they have taken is not is not something that they like it's something that something didn't go to the to plan okay it seems like whoever this person is pile number one they really do not um want you to know about something that has gone wrong maybe it's your child you asking about or maybe this is someone you have tried helping and they said no i know better or something like that where it seems like this person doesn't want you to know that they have screwed up in one way or another okay and um Whatever journey it was that they have taken over here, okay, it didn't, um, at first it seems very exciting here, sorry about my ring light, it seems really exciting and uh, this person seems pumped to jump on that hot air balloon, right, 
but then they suddenly realized that maybe they were not prepared we have two pages here okay uh, they were not prepared and they haven't gathered some kind of information about this uh, maybe physical move maybe some kind of a trip maybe a change of some sorts okay and they are out in a cold now saying you know what um, I feel like maybe I should come back you know from that trip it's something about that journey maybe it's it's um, about self-care journey too you know for some of you that um, they're like damn it you know something about that and um, rest or illness this person uh, doesn't get enough of it okay so they don't get enough of rest and they would like to say that I would like to spend some time on my own so maybe if you're waiting for a message from this person this is them saying i'm sorry i need some time on my own because there are some things that they have to work out in their life right now okay and it seems like they have one person that they are dealing with yeah i said messages and i have my message card coming up here They are saying, I saw a pilot, for some of you might be, um, might be a keyword. I do see a nice big belt and I also do see, as you've seen before, the hot air balloon. Maybe there is, it's talking about a place and uh, it reminded me of um, that place in Turkey. Is it Cappadocia? I don't know if I'm, if I'm pronouncing the name correctly but um it's something about this self-growth stage here that they saying you know what i'm kind of learning from my own mistakes now here and uh, they might be getting a lot of messages from above i mean the universe which they are trying to process and um it feels yeah i mean come on this is like you know understanding oneself um and it seems like this person is kind of in a transitional state of becoming better better as a person improving themselves and um, they need to step out from being the page and uh, step up their game in order to be a king or, or or a queen okay because right now i feel like there is a childish aspect to them that they are like mm. and look I was shuffling and we've got another travel card here okay we have six of swords it's all about that journey i'm talking about i do see a lightning here too maybe that's gonna be influential for some of you there is a plane and i told you i saw a pilot right so maybe for some of you there is some we're talking about someone who is in a good position and they are saying right now you know what i need to learn how to make this change on my own it's something about that i need to learn from my own mistakes give me that space it's something about this energy here okay they're trying to grow from uh, this kind of childish vibration to get to learn everything that life is teaching them right now by themselves and they're saying i need that time okay because they're trying to make a decision about something in their life and it seems like they cannot just yet because this um, self-work hasn't finished yet. There is something still to happen in this person's life in order for them to go to a right direction, okay? Right now, it seems like they are a little bit lost and they are not sure if they made a good decision in their life. And therefore, there needs to be more time um, spent. It's all about travel. What's up? There needs to be more time spent in the place that they are at in order for them to kind of settle and realize what it is that they want to do next are they in a good place uh where they go and that's something they don't want you to know about because they're trying to kind of go through it by themselves yes they are tired and some of them might be maybe a little bit overworked when it comes to this situation but um is their time okay we have four and it says it's their time to settle it's something about maybe even home environment that they're trying to make it feel like home rather than just another place to stay i don't know it's very specific so you know take whatever resonates or if this pile doesn't vibe with you pick another pile 
maybe take bits from this pile only because I on, I'm only talking about someone who has seems like um, change the location or, or is about to do it and is unsure right now okay but they will step up to that king of swords okay they're gonna step up their game but let them experience things don't intervene in their karma if you want to help them if you want to uh, change something about them now is their time to deal with their own stuff okay so i hope that has made sense plan number one thank you for those who are my tribe i love you as usual you are dope and the rest of you i hope i'll see you soon bye for now Hey pile number two people, so whoever has picked this card from intuitive, let's get to business and I am using triple goddess tarot for you guys, okay? So let's see what it is that they would want to tell you and then the next question is what it is that they don't want to tell you, okay? What it is that they want to tell you? We do have, well, they really want to talk guys, <laughs> queen of swords. So for sure, you might hear from them sooner than you think, okay? And I do see someone dropping their mask off. So when, once they co will come towards you, may, you, you will know that they will come for a really open and honest conversation, okay? No bullshit type. Uh, that's what I have to say. Um, and uh, I do not want to have any mask on when I'm talking to you. Let's see what else. We do have the Knight of Cups. This is a beautiful card from tri Triple uh, Goddess, isn't it? I really, really love this card. Now, let's see what else here. Well, sorry, that's a page actually. It's the child. It doesn't say anywhere, so I have to guess sometimes. That's a page. They really want to talk. <laughs> We'll get to business what they want to say, okay? It's a really good energy coming through here. It seems like maybe someone wants to make up whatever has happened in the past. I'm using my Kipper deck now. Whatever has happened in the past, they want to make it right, okay? We have change and we do have, that kind of came together, I have to take it, and something false. So maybe they have talked bs um about you or they have done something that they would want to apologize for because we have that something false card which says you know what maybe someone wasn't playing the game right or wasn't very honest or someone tried to say something that wasn't really nice okay and now is the time when this person is coming back stress and fear yeah they feel really bad whatever the situation is between you two guys they feel really bad and they want it to change okay they are in this distressed uh, state right now that I, that's what i'm seeing what they are like you know what i think i have been preparing for this conversation for a long time um i am feeling like a little bit of a child when it comes to this because of how I acted or maybe that's the way you acted so flip the situations okay and I really want to come towards this person and finally get it out of my chest it's something about this clarity that's needed here for pile number two where things have to be spoken okay and um, those clouds have to go away you know those gloomy clouds have to like this gloomy weather in general whatever it is between you two guys has to go away in order to see that bright sunshine again okay look at the sky there it seems like clarity is needed so badly here let's see what else what do you want to say five of pence Six of Pents hmm. and the Hermit. Okay, so maybe in this situation, one of you have detached from one another, and uh, maybe there was a situation where it wasn't enough equal give and take in this relationship. So, whatever it would be, maybe not enough love being shared between two people, maybe someone didn't literally want to listen to what the other had to say. 
okay and uh, this created this imbalance in this connection i'm not necessarily talking about romantic okay but i do see that some of you guys might have child together so it's like small percentage of you okay and someone has walked away okay and that is what has to be talked about about not being able to previously about uh, not being able to make this relationship and connection stable enough okay someone wants to be um given someone wants to receive as much as they are given and whatever it would be in your case okay so this person wants to say you know what it seems like they want to come and apologize to you but if you know that you are the one who is who was ego driven that's for you okay you have to go and talk to this person and apologize and that's something that has to be done asap here and i feel like if that's your case you are being drawn to do so if that's this other person they are coming quick and they are going they're not gonna hold this in for too much longer okay let's see what else here what it is that they don't want you to know what they don't want to talk about, what they want, okay. Um, I never know what this card is, but it doesn't matter because I read from the pictures in this one. Um, they don't want you to know. Now, be aware for some people, okay, because this person, I think it's an emperor, anyway. This person um, might be a manipulator who's hiding very well. So, you know, take it as it resonates. Make sure that you know the intentions when this person comes to apologize, if they are going to be genuine, if they are, if you see that they are able to change or they're just gonna come back because they need something from you or vice versa. You know, flip situations here if you need to. Someone is a manipulator, possibly here let's see i don't want to like stick to manipulator but i do see that someone is trying to control this connection the way they want it to be let's draw more cards okay obviously and that might have had happened in the past that seven of swords i don't like this card ever it's this honesty lies going behind your back trying to keep secrets of some sorts okay let's see what it is so something has already happened in the past where this happened okay someone has done something um and this person maybe you don't know about this and that's what they are trying to keep from you okay they have been manipulating about something and they've done something that they don't want you to find out and um we do have two of wands reversed where that's all talking about the past though here guys okay um it's saying that this person wasn't sure which way to go let's pull more wasn't sure which way to go uh but they had to leave the place where they were at let's see why the situation that they were in they had to leave it was unbearable for them something has happened where they were like i cannot do this anymore i have to go because i need a fresh start which is not um if i'm gonna stay in the situation i am in now i'm not gonna get my fresh start okay and i really need this let's see what those seven of swords is talking about here what it is Whew, that's that was messy i don't like it one more time okay what is this seven of swords here the devil reversed oh that's not i told you that's not a healthy person is it make sure that you don't um if they come back make sure that you are not naive about this okay there's only so much you can take there is only so much you can allow person to step on your to step on your boundary okay it's um the situation is teaching you something here i don't really like this connection here because it seems very shady make sure that you s do see through those clouds that i talked about okay um let me see what else okay i do see a situation where someone was communicating with someone else behind your back um, well, you see book is being written some kind of notes. So this is some kind of message that was being sent 
between uh, two people that you are not aware of, okay? Something was said, something was sent. Let me just pull some cards from my intuitive. Let's see what's that about. Oh, I don't like this. this is a trickster card we had for the pile number one. Make sure that's another seven of swords in my intuitive deck. Um, two people splitting, kind of going, going separate ways. Okay, one of them does didn't want to go in the distance somewhere and keeping their boundaries. So, okay, maybe one of you guys. There was a situation where one of you. Um, Someone has distanced themselves from another person and one of those people didn't want to let this other person in, okay? So they kept the distance and someone is coming back to the one person now to apologize, but don't think that they have changed, okay? I do not like this energy here. Make sure they come back, they are coming back as a different person because whatever has happened in the past, all those cards that I have here, they are not very nice, okay? I do have the Emperor, the Devil, Seven of Swords, um, the Knight of Swords and the Ten of Wands, okay? And these are very heavy cards. So make sure that that's something that you are aware of, okay? Let me pull a couple of more cards from the Keeper. What it is that I don't want you to know. Right now, they're not feeling the best and that's something they don't want you to know and it makes sense. If you would look at this um, lady in my, one second, in my 10 of wands here. Damn it, why it never focuses? Well, she seems very tired, even though it's not focusing as I want it to. This sucks, but anyway, she seems very tired. She seems very old, you know, so many things has happened over time where she's like, you know what? I have to let go of those uh, burdens that I have on my shoulders. And um, it seems like this person is getting their karma back, but bad karma, whatever it is that they have done before, where they were not honest, they were maybe lying, they were trying to keep um, secrets and they shouldn't have it seems like this person might be getting the bad karma back and they are kind of struggling now okay let's see what else here great happiness reversed yeah i told you they are not very happy right now so um make sure that when they come back to you they want to communicate that it's not something that they need from you because they need it right now themselves. Make sure that um, you do keep your boundaries intact, okay? It's not that you have to be an asshole to them, but um, make sure that there is equal give and take. This person is completely honest. Maybe speak about whatever it was or whatever has happened in the past and um, clear those... Um, Clear the skies, okay? So you can have clarity in the situation. I hope that has helped out. Pile number two, I'm sorry I had to give you, pass you that kind of a message. Maybe it's not for all of you. It's a general reading. I hope uh, whoever is new here, you're gonna join my tribe. My tribe, you are dope. As always, I love you. See you soon. Hello people, whoever has chosen pile number three. This intuitive card over here. Let's get into business. So. We're gonna split it to two. We're gonna do what it is that they would want to tell you and what it is that they wouldn't. And um, I was getting a lot of other messages with this reading for other two piles. So whatever comes through, I'm just gonna talk about it, okay? Let's see which pile wants me to use, wants to be used for your, I feel like the steampunk is looking at me. So we're using steampunk for yours, okay? Let's start with, okay, wait a second. <laughs> Let's start with what it is that they don't want to tell you, okay? Or maybe what it is that they want. Let's see. What they don't. I don't know why. I have started with the other one first in other readings, but maybe that's the way it has to go here. What do they not want to tell you? Okay, Queen of Pentacles. All right, let's see what's that about. Ten of Pentacles reversed. Interesting, interesting. And Eight of Swords reversed. Wow, 
Okay, let's dig deeper here. Okay, that's some drama. <laughs> there is drama. Let me just pull the keeper deck intuitive and we're gonna start talking, okay? This is like, uh, what's it called? Beverly Hills, no? <laughs> Thoughts reversed from the keeper deck. They don't wanna tell you that they are thinking about something we're gonna talk about okay you're like no I'm not thinking about this advice are reversed okay what the heck is going on here main man reversed I am getting a lot of feminine energy here um, There is boundaries, freedom. Ooh. Okay guys, pile number three, they wanna say, I'm not gonna be, you know, I'm not gonna put you guys in a box, but what they wanna tell you is, um, I do see that they might be committed in some cases. Um, I am committed but things are not maybe working the way I want them to work and um, therefore I am stuck in this connection it's something about one person being stuck in a connection that is um, that's not making them fully happy okay it seems like they do want to start fresh they do want to move away okay but they cannot right now we have the Ace of Pentacles reversed and they, are, they keep waiting for a better tomorrow they keep waiting until they will be able to freely walk again okay and I don't think that there is long way to go in order for this to happen the main card that you have chosen from the intuitive deck is telling me that they are thinking about a female who is very curvy sexy or they are I did pick up a lot of uh, feminine energy or they might be the person you're asking about so they are curvy sexy very attractive female okay and um, whoever this person is that they are thinking about they do like to wear something on their head or maybe an accessory of some sort something about it um, very graceful very classy they are thinking about a classy man or classy woman i do see that this is to do guys uh, for pile number three um to do with someone's relationship that that they would like to change or they they are not super happy how this relationship is going and maybe you are asking about your spouse and um, try to talk to this person what it is that's keeping um us in one place what it is that has to be changed you know etc etc I do see boundaries when it comes to moving okay so maybe someone is not able to move this person is not keen on telling you that they are unhappy in one situation and they probably don't want you to know because they are not fully sure yet what it is that they want to do themselves they don't have a plan they're saying okay I don't have a plan yet I keep thinking about this okay it's at the back of my head constantly if it was a pride they would be thinking about this like constantly acknowledging the problem now it's kind of at the back of their head yeah I know but I don't know what to do about this okay and uh, it seems like they have been in the past to an advisor of some sorts and they have tried maybe it's you flip situations you know how it goes um, someone has been to advise of some sorts in order to help out with this uh, and it's involving a main man whoever that main man is to you or them you know what I'm talking about here okay if uh, this is someone who is married to a man um, they were talking to advice about a main man or maybe this is someone who is talking about a main woman you know flip flip it I don't want to put you guys in a box let's see what else here what what is 
the message here what it is that they don't want you to know They don't want you to know that they're unhappy right now. Nine of Cups reversed. They are alright. It's not that they are depressed. Don't get me wrong, okay? They're not depressed, they're fine, but they are not as happy as they would want to be. Nine of Swords reversed. And it seems like their interest, uh, their interest in someone is fading away here, okay? Hmm. And they might be anxious about it they are very anxious about this interest in someone or interest in a dream that they had because nine of cups is also you know dreams coming true uh, the dream that they had of some sorts would it be having a happy relationship would it be having a happy family would it be their own personal dream it's saying it's giving them anxiety now because something is not going the right way and they wouldn't want you to know okay let's see what else we have this card popping out let's see king of pentacles yeah this is definitely i'm talking about someone who is in con committed relationship it started with queen of uh, sorry queen of pent and we do have a king of pens here okay so this is talking about someone's home environment someone's relationship okay they don't want you to know in some cases that they have not finished their relationship with someone so be um be mindful of that that's another storyline so pick the one that suits you too many of you here guys if someone has if okay let's say if you're waiting for a person to split up with someone if especially if they are married this person doesn't want you to know that they don't um they're not planning to do so maybe they have given you hope but it's something about them saying you know what i'm not gonna do this because the family that i have built it's um it's gonna it's gonna cause so much more drama than i would want right now okay yeah and it would be very very unhealthy in this situation it wouldn't be healthy for me and it wouldn't probably be healthy for you it seems like this person is thinking about um changing what it what it is that's a problem in their relationship but it seems like this person is not capable of um of speaking to this other person about the problems that they have just yet they coming through as page of swords they would talk about problems in a way where like you know what um i'm not happy in this i'm not really satisfied but it's a page it's not a king of swords okay kind of like saying one thing but not to, to the fullest okay not finishing what it is that they want to do and say page of wands reversed it's saying they have lost some kind of interest as i said to you before okay Phew. okay i feel like i was talking too much about what it is that they don't want you to know and i've spent nearly 10 minutes on this let me just get all of these cards out of the way let's see what it is that they want you to tell <laughs> they want to tell you <laughs> oh why am i so like sometimes spaced out when it comes to i do get really like involved in the whole scenario so i don't even see the time by the way we are using the texture tarot for a question what it is that they want to tell you let's see what we got here we have the knight of pentacles reverse saying someone is impatient let's see what it was happening here the empress reversed I told you something about page of pentacles sorry page of pens it was knight of pens re reversed right the first one it's something about someone losing the sexual pull towards someone else someone losing interest in someone else the empress is reversed you know she's not in her power Page of Wands, there's so so much young energy here. They will... <laughs> okay, I see what's happening here. Bear with me. That's very random now, guys. But whoever has 
planned any kind of um, gig or you wanted to maybe go to a concert, I do see music. Anything to do with music, this person cannot wait to go. They, they would want you to know that they can't wait to go somewhere. King of Swords reversed. Lovers reversed. I don't know why, but what's this what's coming through here? This person would like you to know that they are not as experienced in uh, maybe relationships or in dealing with other people in relationships as they would want to be. Okay. Um now another thing here That's very, your pile is very dramatic, but this is like making me like, okay, what's going on? In some cases, okay, I do see a situation where this person would want you to know that um, it's like they would want to admit that there was a time in the past where there was one lady or maybe if we're talking about a okay let's say uh, there was a time in the past where they were in relationship with someone else for a short time and um, there was a possibility to have a child with that person and I'm not gonna get into this how it ended but um, they would want you to know that there was a situation where this other person might have gotten pregnant. So that's probably 0.1% uh, who's gonna vibe with this. But I do see two pages here, okay? Two children, two pages are upright. The rest of the cards are reversed. This is saying that this person might be dealing with kids and this person has a very youthful kind of personality too. And they really do love kids this person wants you to know that they love kids we got there right <laughs> they do love teaching they do love music and they do love kids and if you have plans for this person when it comes to going to some kind of gig or listen to live music whatever it, it it is that involves music okay they can't wait to go page of cups reversed Four of Swords upright. Another scenario coming through here. And Seven of Wands upright. It seems like I'll just see someone because I'm not sure who, who it is in this case, okay? Or you're them. It seems like someone wants to say, um, you know, Page of Cups is someone who is attracted to someone else. Um, they are saying, you know what, right now I don't have the love. Right now I'm very concentrated on myself. And I, I kind of want to tell you, it's a bit like a friend zone happening here, okay? I kind of want to tell you, but if you looked at this card that I have over here, uh, it's not very visible, but there are two faces screaming from anger. This person is afraid to tell you something where you might react like, oh my God, like what the fuck? Uh, and it comes together with page of cups like when it comes to expressing feelings this person is gonna try to do so being open but this person is also afraid of you reacting to some kind of situation when it comes to opening up um in a way that is not gonna be chilled in a way where it's gonna be like a proper chaos <laughs> or maybe you are feeling like that maybe you want to friend, friend zone someone and that's something you want to talk about, okay? Like, I really love spending time with you, but um, I think maybe it's better if we finish as friends. And we do have justice here. Let's see what, what that's talking about. Seven of Cups, okay? Well, I see what's going on here.
it seems like uh this person wants to communicate with you and tell you things but it seems like they are afraid of you and i don't know why whatever it is that they would tell you not like they would want to say that this situation is too fragile and i'm afraid whatever it is between you two guys uh one of you might be acting as a mentor to one another and one person wants to say you know what i feel like whatever we want to do together it's a bit too fragile and therefore i don't know if i can pull through um because my intuition is saying that go in the distance so that's another scenario right let's just see what else go in the distance it's going to be a bit of a chaos for me and again it goes together with seven of cups you know if you pull one of those cards away um it everything is gonna crumble down so maybe this person uh, doesn't want to influence this relationship in a way that is going to uh, make it worse for you two it seems like this person really appreciates the relationship you have now and this person doesn't want to say something bad um, in case it changes the whole vibration of the ooh, changes the whole vibration of the relationship the connection you have okay last card let's see what's up yeah they wanna they wanna keep working on this relationship the way it is okay uh slowly peacefully um kind of keep things steady but they're very excited about one gathering or maybe one event that you both might be going to okay so i've spent so much more time on pile number three than other it's still not fair but i had to get this drama sorted for you guys somehow i hope you are going to join my tribe my tribe as usual you are dope i love you all for coming back and i'm gonna catch you in the next one bye